it's just a no kind of day y'all it's just a no kind of day but anyway so today we are going to do the charcoal clay bubble mask and this is by sue a e and it's refreshing pore care so they have like oxygen bubbles in it and the charcoal clay and refining our pores and all that good stuff so i actually got this from walmart a while ago it was either like a dollar 99 or 2.99 but i'm kind of pretty sure it was dollar 99 but i will double check that um so i had got like three of these um different kinds but this is like the last one that i had left that i hadn't already done off camera so i was like oh this will be fun um and i'm gonna pair it with my vivitar facial cleansing brush i will actually put that video somewhere up here so you can check to see how this works just like with a regular cleanser because this is supposed to bubble up so we're gonna see how this works i don't know um so it's all in one mask instantly purifies troubled skin with a combined power of activated benchatan charcoal kaolin and bentonite clay which is all really really good for your skin i've used them all well not the kaolin but the bentonite clay and the activated charcoal um separately before so i do know that it's good for your skin and oxygen bubbles active benches hand powerful enough to purify water is renowned anti-inflammatory known to refine and brighten skin so i just literally washed my face i didn't wake up like this um with my bior free your pores baking soda cleanser and that's typically like my go-to facial cleanser like every day so you're supposed to do this on clean skin so that's what i cleaned it with and then what are we else supposed to do? Evenly on drip or dot. <laughs> Dry or damp face. Avoid your eyes and your mouth. Then we're gonna massage upwards and outwards in circular motion. That's why I'm gonna use this because it's already going in circles. There it is. And we'll just make sure we're going up and out. So let's get started. So I'm gonna open it. So it's a push from top to bottom before I open it. Okay, so now that we have it open, I'm just gonna squeeze it up. It doesn't really feel like anything's in there. Like, oh, there it is. Okay. Feels very goopy. Okay, I'm just gonna try to spread this on. It's not as thick, like it doesn't feel like mud, like normal clay masters, so that's pretty cool. So I'm like, I don't know if my face is gonna get hard, but we gonna see. It actually did lighten up pretty quick. Oh, it is bubbling, hear it? sounds like popping bubble wrap <laughs> oh and it feels it feels when you're like it's like you feel like you feel the fizzies like all over your skin like it's crazy and that's it, it was quite a bit of product in this little thing i underestimated this i really didn't i'm gonna just put it down on my neck because i think i got my face pretty good oh god it like <laughs> it tickles like I'm extremely ticklish, so like these bubbles popping on my face is like crazy. Okay, so that's what we got. It's like fizzing up all of my eyebrows. And you can hear it. Okay, it's a crazy feeling. Okay, so as you can see, it's all bubbled up. I'm gonna turn my brush on and we're gonna do upward and outward in circular motion. Stuff is like everywhere. 
A little goes a long way. Like I probably could have got two things out of this one pack. I don't think I need it probably the whole thing. I would say my skin is feeling good. So I'm gonna go and rinse this off and I'll come back. Okay y'all, so I just literally just rinse off the rest and I'm just gonna wipe off around the sides because yeah, like the more water you kept adding to it, the more, um, like it just kept bubbling. Like it just kept, it just wouldn't stop. So yeah, so. But I will say my face feels really, really good. Like I will buy this again. I probably won't use as much because it just got kind of got <laughs> like at a point. But I will buy this again. Like my face feels like firm to the touch, like feels supple. If I could say that. Um, it feels clean, like it doesn't feel like eek, eek, like that squeaky squeak. Like it still feels like my face has some type of um like moisture in it. When I use Bentonite clay by itself one time. Um, that's the kind of thing it got hard. I think that was that one. It got hard, but it, um, it just left my face feeling like, like I just had needed to put something on afterwards. Like this doesn't feel that good, that bad. So I'm, I don't know, maybe it has something in it that makes it feel that way. Let's read. Mm -mm, I don't really see anything that's moisturizing in here. At least not by first name, but here's a close-up of my skin. And I typically always get like blackheads on my nose. So that's why I normally use like a pore clean cleanser cleaner every day because like I have combination skin around the edges pretty dry and then T-zone gets a little oily. So but yeah, I like it. I would I mean out of all the masks that I've tried so far on my channel, you can kind of Go back and look at a few of them. This has been my favorite. I liked it. I will buy it again. And it was like super cheap. So yeah, so let's see how many times are you supposed to use this? Oh, you have to use the whole packet because it says use immediately after opening. So it's not really something that you can like kind of save. So yeah, I mean, I guess once a week maybe. And like I said, it was probably like $2. But that's like how the bubbles looked and it was like I could feel it bubbling on my face so I really like this it's a thumbs up for me I definitely would purchase again let me know if you tried any of the other like Walmart masks or by this company I'm gonna probably look some more of them up because I like this my, my skin feels I feel like I have a little bit of a sheen to my face a little bit so yeah so let me know in the comments guys on what you think about it or if you try some what should be my next pickup See you guys soon.